I think one of the biggest questions we all have when it comes to retirement is how much is enough? How much am I going to need? And that can be a, a tricky question to try and answer, but there's a few simple tools we can use to help us try and pack that and get to an answer that works for us. I think the first thing is to try and understand some of the changes that may happen to our monthly budget when we retire. And so it's useful to think through what are the main things you're spending on today and how could that change? For instance, do you expect to still have dependents when you retire? It may surprise you to find that research is showing that around a third of employed South Africans today are supporting not only their children, but their parents. And so the issue of having dependents in retirement is definitely a topical one. So will you have dependents? Another thing to remember is how much um, medical treatment and medical expenses might you have? We know that as we grow older, unfortunately our, our bodies don't work as well and we need more and more medical treatment. Um, some research done in the US a couple of years ago showed that the average 70 year old had double the medical costs of the average 50 year old. And so when you're thinking about retirement, it's wise to plan for um, more and more to be spent on medical care. Another thing to remember is inflation. If you think about 10 or 15 years ago, uh, what we paid for a loaf of bread is way, way less than what we pay today. And that's really a feature of inflation, so we've got to think about that. And so you can use that kind of information to decide how much income would I need if I were actually retiring today compared to what I'm earning now. What would I need? Would I need the same? Would I need a little bit less? And perhaps if you had a situation where you didn't have dependents anymore, you didn't have any debt, and uh, you, you were fairly healthy, you might need less. Um, but then again, you might want to uh, enjoy the time you have and have a, uh, do traveling and do other things and, and enjoy your, your, your time. So use that as a guide to see how much income you need. We talk about uh, something called a replacement ratio, and really it's that calculation I was talking about, where you say, compared to what I was earning today, say it was 10,000 rand, how much do I think I'd need if, if I were retiring? Um, if you need a little bit less, maybe 7,500, we'd say the replacement ratio that you're aiming for is 75%. If you felt you needed the same, we talk about a 100% replacement ratio. In other words, your income you need in retirement should be 100% of what you're earning today. Once you're clear on that, then you're able to sit with uh, a financial advisor uh, or someone who's familiar with these things and they can work out how much you need to save in order to reach that goal. Um, but as a rough rule of thumb, saving anywhere between 15 to 20% of your take-home pay is probably what's needed to get a replacement ratio uh, of 80% or higher. Um, and so that's a kind of level we, we need to aspire to when we think about our retirement savings.